Alright, so day one, here we go into the wilderness. Well, we're about halfway and uh, starting to feel it. Start to feel it in the legs, start to feel it in the butt. Okay, so we just made it to the top. We're gonna start looking for some deer now. Slowly making our way, finding a camp spot, a nice flat spot. We're gonna shred, we're gonna shred, and we're gonna go to the distance. We're gonna go the fucking distance here, buddy. Let there be fire. Get some trusty B roll. Lasagna. We're up here having a good old time chasing down them monster muleys. This is how we're doing it. We're sleeping on the ground because we didn't bring a tent. Russell, what was the temperature here last night? 20 degrees. All right, cool. So we're going to die from freezing tonight. <laughs> and uh, the deer are going to be right there. We watched them go to sleep. We didn't see any big bucks, but hopefully tomorrow we wake up. And they're sitting right there. They wake up with us. All right. We just woke up. Pretty crazy night. Russell tried to snuggle. Um, it started snowing. I froze my ass off, so... Yeah, good night. All right, here goes day two. We're looking for the monster mealy. Haven't been able to find anything yet. We camped right up here. So we're right along this ridge. So, yeah. So how was last night, Russ? I slept fine. I was nice and warm. I wasn't, I was freezing. There was a little bit of snow. Russell woke me up, he's all like, dude, it's snowing. Whoa, dude. Oh, man. Wake up. There was no stuff. Game time. Do you see which one you want? You got him. Hold on. Let me get my eyes on him. Didn't see. I don't see him. Dude, he's down, dude. He's fucking smoked. He's in that bush dead. Come here, buddy. All right, Russ. I didn't get it on video. But fuck it. <laughs> Russ, out of boy, Russ. Out of boy, Russ. He's fucking folded, dude. Russell. Oh, I'm so pumped right now. Fuck. What do you think, dude? Dude, it's so pumped. No three point? Well, dude, dude, I didn't see how big he was. I mean, he was, I good. He was a good three point. I was checking him out. All right, all right, dude. Fuck, dude, I'm shaking. Dude. I was fucking... <laughs> Give me some bumps, dude. dude. That was fucking sick. Dude. He just folded. <laughs> Come on up here, buddy. Grab your buck. Ah. Oh, dude. He's got some character. You got him, bud. Yeah. It's looking good. Oh, man, dude. That's so cool. Come here. Give me some freaking knuckles, dude. Yeah, I love boy. you, man. That's him. That's the fourth point we've been going after. Drove you want to three hours from Reno. Stay the night. We come out in the morning. We spot some bucks up high on the hill. Nothing crazy big though. Just a bunch of little guys. A couple forkies and a ton of does. We're like, all right, you know. Josh had to go to work, so we went back down to town. We'll, we'll make a new plan in the morning or in the afternoon when he get off work. He gets off work. Says we should go camp. Let's just go hike up and camp up there. 
So we went, we hiked a couple hours up steep hill, steep terrain, camped out by a rock outcropping across the valley over here. It snowed on us all night, it was freezing, but it was worth it for this buck, man. It was worth it. Pretty cool. We have footage of him in full velvet from four weeks ago when I hunted him in archery. I first saw him up here, I got 40 yards away from this buck and he, he caught my wind and he was gone. Um, really disappointing for that, but you know what? It all works out in the end. We were watching those guys for about a half hour, just okay, they're gonna be bedded down soon, and they're way up the mountain. They're two miles away. It's vertical train. Vertical <laughs> train. It's and by the time we get there and the route we take, we don't know if they're gonna be there. And we're sitting there, and I'm like looking around, and I look over Russell's shoulder, which is sitting behind me. And I look over, I'm like, Russell, do not move. There are three deer sitting right behind you. Three legal bucks sitting right behind you. There's a three point sitting right behind you. So, he's the most patient guy in the world. He gave me a lot of time to get the camera. Unfortunately, I didn't get the shot, but it's all good. Uh, you know, it all works out in the end. We got all ready, and uh, I told him, I just said, oh, I'm not ready, but he didn't hear me, so. But you know what? The point of it is that we get to go home with this guy today. We're very grateful for this guy. Big, beautiful creature that will feed me for months. Exactly, man. That's what it's all about right here. This is what it's all about. Deer hunting. Yeah, I, uh, I'm pretty stoked on helping get this buck for us. Congratulations, bud. Yeah, thanks for guiding us. It's pretty rad.